Alright, looks like Cape Cod was a little windy that day. Still, an excellent submission and the first one we've had from the state of Massachusetts. So thank you very much for sending that in. Today's quiz will be episode number 474, 21 answers that start with the letter O. There will be 20 regular questions at the beginning and at the very end of the quiz there will be a question 21 tiebreaker. Thank you for watching this weekend and good luck on today's quiz. Question 1. What is the term for a word that phonetically imitates, resembles, or suggests the sound that it describes? Common examples include animal noises such as oink, meow, roar, and chirp. Those words are all onomatopoeias. Question 2. The Titanic sank on her maiden voyage and the Britannic sank four years later after hitting a mine. But what sister ship, British Ocean Liner and lead ship of the White Star Line survived 24 years? There was the Titanic, the Britannic, and the Olympic. Question 3. The Academy of Motion Pictures, Arts, and Sciences issues annual awards called the Academy Awards of Merit that officially adopted what nickname for the trophies in 1939? Those trophies are called the Oscars. Question 4. What is the first name shared by both the man who single-handedly revolutionized the world's popcorn industry and the first person to sustain flight in a powered airplane? The answer is Orville. Orville Redenbacher and Orville Wright. Question 5. What is the name of the wild cat, medium-sized and characterized by solid black spots and streaks on its coat, round ears, and white neck and undersides? That medium-sized cat is called an ocelot. Question 6. In the field of mathematics, an angle that is greater than 90 degrees but less than 180 degrees is referred to as what type of angle? The answer is obtuse. Question 7. What is the name of the Hasbro board game where members must remove items such as bread basket and water on the knee from Cavity Sam without setting off the buzzer? The answer is Operation. Question 8. Named after a hunter in Greek mythology, what is the prominent constellation located on the celestial equator that is one of the most recognizable constellations in the night sky? That constellation is Orion. Question 9. An opus is a piece of work that is usually musical, and in Latin, the preferred plural of opus is what word which everyone also associates with music?
the plural of opus is opera. Question 10. According to Greek legend, what man played his own beautiful music to drown out that of the sirens to save the Argonauts from certain death? His name was Orpheus. Question 11. Played by the child actor Ron Howard, what was the name of Andy Taylor's son in the 1960s CBS television series, The Andy Griffith Show? His name was Opie. Question 12. What is the bone disease that occurs when the body loses too much bone, makes too little bone, or both, and as a result, bones become weak and may break easily? The answer is osteoporosis. Question 13. Although it is originally from the Bhagavad Gita, the quote, Now I am become death, the destroyer of worlds, is often associated with what director of the Manhattan Project? His name was Oppenheimer, Robert Oppenheimer. Question 14. Unlike Donkey, who thinks that they are similar because they stink, according to Shrek, ogres are like what vegetable because they both have many layers? Shrek says, ogres are like onions. Question 15. Featured prominently on the Legend of Zelda games for the N64, what is the name of the ancient wind musical instrument whose name translates from the Italian for Little Goose? That instrument is called an ocarina. Question 16. A god of war who appeared in Norse mythology as the protector of heroes and who welcomes home fallen warriors when they join him in Valhalla. The answer is Odin. Question 17. What is the name for both a type of large hawk moth and a shrub covered in exotic pink or white flowers that is toxic to both humans and animals? The answer is oleander. Question 18. One of the busiest airports in America, what is the name of the airport located on the northwest side of Chicago, Illinois, and is featured in movies like 1990's Home Alone? The name of that airport is the O'Hare International. Question 19. With over 150 varieties of the plant, vanilla is the only edible fruit of what flower family, the second largest family of flowering plants in the world? The answer is orchids. Vanilla is an orchid. Question number 20. The ancient Egyptian god of the dead, 
who was the god of resurrection into eternal life, ruler, protector, and judge of the deceased. The answer is Osiris. All right, that is it. Thank you for watching this episode of Road Trippia, and thank you for a great weekend. The last two days have been back-to-back -back our best two days ever in terms of number of people viewing and the amount of watch time. So that is awesome. We've never done that before where we've had two back-to-back -back best days. We also got a ton of new subscribers this weekend and several more entries into our intro challenge. So the rest of the week we will have new intros at the very beginning of the videos. I was a little nervous there because we didn't fill them all up and I had to do a blank one the other day. But we do have some more entries. There's still a few spots left at the end of the alphabet. But the next few days we will have entries from a couple of different countries and a couple of different states in America. Here is question 21 today, the tiebreaker category of O. Cleopatra's Needle and the Washington Monument are examples of what tall, four-sided, narrow, tapering monument which ends in a pyramid-like shape or a pyramidion at the top? What type of monument is Cleopatra's Needle and the Washington Monument? The answer is obelisk. They are both obelisks. Thanks for watching today. Check back tomorrow for LMNOP trivia. Answers that start with P.